Hey, what's up, YouTube family? I'm back. Uh, I got a free sample of color enhancement. So this is the Black Gold by Rich Shell Twenty Seven. So sent this over. Thankfully, I just got this in a mail, and I'm excited to check it out. I haven't opened it yet, but I want to see what uh, what it looks like, what it smells like. It's hard to describe the smell. I mean, they all smell a little bit different. And I don't think that even really matters. But this is the black gold color enhancement and the free sample size. Got that phone number on there too. It's at 731-468-6898. And I know you can hit him up on Instagram because he hit me up and talked to me about this one. So, I mean, I'm ready. I'm just gonna load it up. I'm gonna spray it on. I have some enhancements on my hair. But I'm gonna wipe it off and put these on and see what happens. See what it looks like. So I'll put that straight into the compressor. I don't know if you can see it. Focus on it. I always do the paper towel, then I do my hand, and then I do the hair. So I just want to see how it comes out. So there's two. One paper towel. Test it on my hand just to see kind of how I need to layer it and see what it acts like on the skin before I actually put it on. So I'm just gonna dry this off a little bit. This is just my alcohol. I'm gonna take it back off, see if it comes off. In case I spray too much or overspray like I did right here, make sure I can back it off with alcohol if I need to. Which it looks like I can. So I like that it looks like it came out black with uh, a gold undertone, because we usually tint the skin, you know, not the hair. So. That's good. I'm excited about that. And then uh, it kind of reminded me of the no drip so far. So I'm gonna spray. So you can see where mine are on my hairline, I think. So I'm gonna spray and take all mine off. This is from OG Walker, the one that I use or have been using. So I'm gonna back that all the way off.
Then I got out, picked out with my special pick. I do have to get the first couple of drips off. Drops off. We'll see. I did that. And I kind of did my beard and mustache just for fun. So it's pretty dry to the touch. The ones I did are from uh, two days ago. So thankfully they lasted. But so far this is dry to the touch. So I'm glad about that. And let's see if it wipes out the water. Or if water makes it runny or anything like that. A little bit. Not a whole lot, I don't think, but. A little bit, but it still looks like it should last. Especially if you're not outside sweating or you know, running around a lot or trying to actively scrub it off. It looks like these will last. I missed the spot. I'm sure you can see it. The only thing is it looks like it goes on a little bit shiny. That might be the gold undertone, but the fact that it goes on shiny just makes it seem like um, It'll match my skin better once it does dry and look a little bit more matte and natural. That's why I use a dark brown on the one that I have. So this one, a gold and brown, been pretty good. So, I don't know. Let me know what you think. That's how it looks on the mustache. And the beard.
it's not rubbing right off, which is a good sign, especially on the mustache, because sometimes they do. So overall, it's a good product. Let me know. I think it's a good product so far, at least a lot better than the ones that I had used, which had been sometimes just the, uh, the Kiss Express and the alcohol. So let me know what you think. Let me know what questions you have and check out the website and let them know what you think about the product too. All right, thanks and I'll talk to you soon.